For the first step, you want to head over to search and type in CMD, then we're going to run it as administrator. And then click on yes. Once we're on it, we're going to type in ipconfig space forward slash flush DNS and click on enter. For the next command, we're going to type in ipconfig space forward slash release and click on enter. Next, we're going to type in ipconfig space forward slash renew and click on enter. When that's done, we're going to type in netsh space winsock reset and click on enter. Don't restart the computer yet as it says. Don't restart it. Now we're going to close out CMD. Now for the second step, we're going to head over to search and type in view network connections. Once you're on it, you want to select either Ethernet or Wi-Fi. Whichever one you have, just select it and then click on properties and then click on Internet Protocol version 4. And you want to make sure that use the following DNS server address is ticked. Once that's been ticked, you want to make the first line 8888 and you want to make the second line 8844 and then you want to click on OK. After you do all of this, now restart your computer and the problem should be fixed.